Oh, the kazoo. You know, the kazoo is a surprisingly challenging instrument to play if you are slightly toned up. I thought I thought I would be good at playing the kazoo because I'm not very musically inclined. I come from a musical family. My father was a musician. It just skipped a generation, I guess. I don't know. I'm a little tone deaf. But um, I do play the stereo really well, though, and really loudly. Uh, but the kazoo, I thought I'd just be able to I would be like humming. But I, I guess if you're not good at humming on key, you probably aren't very good at kazooing on key either. So, <laughs> yeah, me and the kazoo, not very good friends. I don't know why I decided to share that with you. You're just so remarkably easy to talk to. Uh, that is Walter Martin and his sister. We've got... Uh, Twin Pop on the way, John Mulaney, the comedian, and the Sack Lunch Bunch, and Dora the Explorer on the way. Also, Davi Diggs is going to sing a song. Davi Diggs from Hamilton. Yeah, he's got a holiday tune coming up in a little bit. But right now, we got a llama, and he's got a phone call. Our nervous llama friend, Lorenzo Llama, at 1-866-328-2345. Hello, thank you for holding on the line. Lorenzo Llama speaking. How may I help you? Hi. Hello. What is your name? Kennedy. Kennedy. I, I am Lorenzo. Hi. Hi. Are you a llama corn? I am not a llama corn. <laughs> if I had a horn on my head, I would be a llama corn. But no, I'm not. Could I tell you something? To tell you something? Uh, yeah. yeah, one time. Uh, one time I took a uh, stick what? and I put it on my head and I told everybody I was a llama corn. But this wasn't true. I was a fraud. <laughs> yeah. I just like the idea of having a horn on my head and being magical. I think that would be awesome. What's your favorite color? Brown. <laughs> Yeah, pretty much. But she has a problem also. There are very many brown llama corns or unicorns. I guess if there were llama corns, they would probably be brown. Yeah, probably. Or beige. A lot of beige, I would imagine, yeah. Because beige is like, like a light brown. Like if you took white and, and brown together, you'd probably get beige. Beige. Khaki. Maybe khaki. What you... happens if I touch, like, touch you? What happens if you touch me? Yeah. Oh, you can't touch me because there's no touching a llama corn. There's no touching a llama. Llama corns are very magical. And they're, oh wait, that's right. I'm not a llama corn. I forgot. Oh, uh, yeah. I just freak out and go, don't touch me, don't touch me, and run around a lot. Yeah, it makes me nervous. You know nervous? You know nervous? Yeah. Nervous? Yeah, that's me. I get that way when people talk about grabbing me and grabbing my fur. <laughs> But if I was a llama corn, say I'd have a horn on my head and I would be magical and it wouldn't be a problem, would it? No, it wouldn't. But am I a llama corn? No. Sorry. Yeah. I give good hugs. You give good hugs? Yes. Oh, uh, that sounds like I'm missing out then. If I was a llama yeah, corn. Yeah. If I was a llama corn, you could hug me, but yeah, well, as, as we've established, it's not happening. Well, anyway. I can some... give you a carrot. You can give me a what? A carrot so you can be a llama corn. You can give me a carrot so I can be a llama corn? I yeah. love carrots. You can put it on your head. Oh, yeah. Gotta be honest with you, if you give me a carrot, I'd probably eat it. Yeah, really? that would be tough. Wow, what a tough decision that would be. If you gave me a carrot, I could choose to eat the carrot or put it on my head and be a llama corn. Wow. That would be a tough call. Yeah. Still probably eat it. Still probably eat it. But I really want to be a unicorn. That would be awesome. But yeah, I'd probably eat it. Probably, I probably would, yeah. Probably. Let's, I'm, just being, I'm just being honest. You know, honest. You know, honest. I'm just being honest. Yeah. Anyway, so just a regular old llama over here, and not a llama corn, not a unicorn, don't have a carrot, and do have a weird phobia about people trying to pet me, even though I live in a petting zoo. I think we pretty much covered all the bases. Kennedy, thank you very much for calling in today. Can I ask you a question? Yeah. Are you a llama corn? No. 
Okay, I was just checking. I, was, I was thought, thought maybe you were just I'm a unicorn. Kidding. What say? I'm a unicorn. You're a unicorn? Yeah. Really? Yep. Well, put in a good word for me, will you? I could totally use one of those horn things. Okay. Or just a carrot. Okay. Actually, I could go for. I could totally go for a carrot. To be totally honest with you, that'd be fine too. Whatever. Yeah. Anyway, it was good to talk to you, Unicorn Kennedy. Unicorn Kennedy. Bye. Okay. Goodbye. Goodbye. Okay. Goodbye. Man, I really want to be a llama corn. <laughs>